Hello everyone and welcome to another part on HTML curves. We discussed unordered and ordered lists in the last two videos and learned how to create them. But in HTML, there is another type which is called description list. So in this tutorial, we are going to learn what description list is and how to create it. So a description list is simply a list of items with description. For example, on the screen to the left, you see an unordered list with some items. And there you find no description. Items are only listed one after another. Now on the right on your screen, you see a description list. The list has items like VS Code, Sublime, Notepad. And under every item, you see items description. So this is how a description list looks like. Now take a look, what are the tags that we use to create a description list? List by itself is created using the DL tag. And DL stands for description list. And as you write DL tag, your list is actually created. Now for adding the item or the term, we use DT tag. DT stands for description term, or you can simply call it the item. And finally, we use DD element to specify the item's description, right? Let's now code it into the HTML document. First, you will create a description list using DL tag. Then you are gonna add an item inside using DT tag. And we can add VS code. Now the item or the term is added. And for adding description, so just under the DT tag, we will write DD tag. Okay, so DD for description. And here we will write text that describes the item or the IDE made by Microsoft. Right? So our list is completed. We have a list, description list. We have a term or the item and we have items description. Let's now save the file and render it into the browser. Now reload the page and there we have a nice description list. So it's not so difficult to program a description list and if you want so you can create some variations. For example, you can define multiple terms with single description or you can define a single term with multiple description. Or you can even define description list with multiple terms and multiple descriptions. Let me show you a couple of examples. If you want to define multiple terms with single description, then you just need to add another DT element. For example, add another DT here. And here we can write Visual Studio Community. Okay, so now we have multiple terms with a single description. And you can insert another description if you want using the DD tag. Open a DD tag. And here you can write the description. Right? Now the list has multiple terms and multiple descriptions. And if you just remove a term from here, like this, so it becomes a list with single term and multiple description. So it's very simple to implement these variations. So in this tutorial, we learn how to create description list. And we've already discussed unordered and ordered list in our previous videos. Now we have covered all the three types of lists that we have in HTML. So I will see you in the next tutorial. Thanks for watching.